Hello and welcome back to Fallout 3 because truly Lord is injured and mad. Hi Lord, the first is how much you're speaking in Global 32, Box is mad and cute as fuck at 13. And all around neutral guy, I guess. Oh, <gasps> look! No weird graphics switch this time. Those are three episodes. I should have closed the game between episodes to get cleared it out, I guess. Ah, it's time for us to go ahead and to locate the Rocco facility. I guess the quickest way there is from Babel 66 power station or Choco's pop and gas stop. So let's go that way. Hello? Anyone here? Good. Right then, uh, first, I think I'm gonna follow the road until it turns right again. So, maybe I should just cut tr straight through the wasteland. That would be more interesting. Also, it appears I have abandoned Fox. I think I just thought that, you know, him saying, me saying that, yeah, come on, follow me in the end of the conversation was enough, but. Uh, I forgot about the part where I told him not to follow me and instead answer a question. Which you know was kinda silly. But it's fine. Just straight towards the quest marker we go. Hoping we don't accidentally stumble right into a goddamn nest. Of alien invaders or death claws. Or Yagwais. Those are terrible as well. Yogi bears, as they're called. They're smarter than your average, but. Oh, what's that? I've never been there. Maybe I can go and explode everyone in that place. It's, it looks like the sort of place where you can just do that without too much consequences. Probably not very nice people there anyway. How did that construction stay that intact? I guess that must be the Rocco facility, which is also very much intact. But this must be a small gathering of gusts, winds. Sweet motion of the air. This area seems very, very clear of everything. Ooh. Not sure, should I go there first or there first? This one's closer. Yeah, I do quick save every two steps because that's the safest way to play. And safety is important, kids. It is. I've or so I've been told anyway. Let's get some pre-war money. Vapple 684 actually. 84 power station. There's a stain of blood. I don't like it. There's another. Still don't like it. There's a torso. I'm starting to like the situation even less. There's a lot of ammunition boxes. I'm gonna take those. I'm gonna take the entire box. Come on, pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Okay, does anyone remember what pieces I still required for my uh, thingy? Uh, I know I have a handbrake, a gas tank, and a pilot light. That leaves me requiring what? What, 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 what? Legendary. That's a rocket launcher. I can clear and leave blower, fire hose, nozzle conductor. I require what is known as the shish kebab. A lawnmower blade. That's what I require. Okay, cool. Grab those. Whose torso is this? It doesn't seem very safe to be around in an area where there are just random torsos about. Ok. 
Okay. Is there anything in these places ever? I know some of them had facilities surrounding them. Well, small uh, house buildings. Sheds. Holy shit. Of holiness and stuff. Yeah. I think that was exactly what they had. Quite. Now. The Robco facility is not far from here. So I'm going to get straight to it. And I'll do my best to explode it. I mean, do not explode it. I'll do my best to not explode the whole facility. Because that would be bad. Oh, look at that pretty house over there. Yeah. It's actually pretty that that thing. Because that thing is quite broken at sides. Okay, who do you have? Sergeant and Pikachu. I'm not entirely sure they are passive. Or friendly. Or anything of the type that doesn't try to kill me. So I'm just going to see if there is a way in from this direction. So I don't have to instantly go ahead and fight everyone I see. I still think I'm meant to stealth into the facility anyway. To lower the chances of being able to stick in the widget without destroying every bloody robot first. But they're heading that way. So it should be safe. It should be fine. There should be no issues of being attacked by a ton of uh, robots. These aren't active models, are they? I don't think they are. Alright, let's be practical. They go to the station first and then worry about every other model. Oh. The marker is that way. I also perceive that there are multiple enemies about. They seem to be mostly rats and roaches there. So I might be able to just sneak on by. Nope, one of them's got one of them got angry. It's a roachy roach. Roach roach. Roach roach. Roach roach roach. roach. And we have one of these guys as well. But this is an area where I don't want to use ammo, so I just cut them all apart. There's no need to stealth anymore, we've been detected. Always grab the bottle cap mines. Search protector and four energy cells, sure. I'm actually I'm hidden right now, so I may as well move about. Like this. Uh, plus uh, melee criticals are I think especially now since I became a ninja That's that's right. I'm a ninja now Did you know? It's the truth. I am a ninja and I'm dual wielding plunges That's right That's exactly right But there's one Gonna stab it in the bum. Bum stab performed. I'm gonna stab this in the bum. Bum stab performed. Road roach barbecue. Using the barbecue stick. Red roach, even. It's a road roach if it's a. Whatchamacallit? A shish kebab. This is actually my weapon. My weapon is a shish kebab. That doesn't count. That's not the sort of shish kebab I meant. 
Where is the... Ah, office is in cafeteria. Sounds like my kind of place. No one saw a thing. There is no random roach fire. I guess the roaches don't go aggressive, it's the... Uh, more rats that do. Look at the size of them buggers there, that's... That guy looks as tall as I am. Oh well. Wait, the controls... Are apparently that way. So here in the toilets, is this where the controls are? Or just this next room? Which is not at all the toilets. It's supposed to be in that direction there. Might be on another floor. Yeah, I think that's the case. Left the roaches on the bum. Right on the bum. He's where we slept the roaches. Oh, we've been detected by this rat over here. But it's fine. Ah, yeah, this looks like a mainframe. Dingy. Let's stick the widget in the other widget. Oh, mean framiness. With this brief or book, I'm maybe able to sell it for 100 caps should I decide to return to the library again. Install the processor widget. Do not attempt to flee. Justice will be administered. Damn it. Okay. Time to hack the thing as well. Uh, generally, it is wrong, so... Um, no. Initially. There we go. Suicidal was not the wrong thingy. Uh, orientation guide. Congratulations on your transfer to the position of robot protocol operator. Your trusted co-workers will be the standard protector models stationed throughout the facility. Basic operation covers the day-to-day -day functionality of your co-workers. As described in detail in your training panel, post-extermination encourages your co-workers to track and set as any roaches, rodents and other undesired pests on the premises. Total liquidation removes your co-workers' humanoid safety protocols and this water for use only in the unlikely event of criminal intrusion or communist attack. Robot shutdown allows you to temporarily retire your co-workers for the regular maintenance or in the case of accidental liquidation commands. You trust you'll find the work simple, rewarding extre and extremely safe. Um, cease total liquidation. Yes. Okay. Cool. Just kill all the roaches and the stuff. Right? Is that the option on? Basic observation. Factory power supply insufficient. But they're still gonna kill all the roaches, so it's fine. Wait, no, not the missile launcher. Disintegrator is fine. Now I don't need to stealth anymore because I know everyone's cleaning up my mess already. At least this task was very easy to solve. Mm -hmm. Eventually, I'll learn how to pick blocks. But day is not that day. They seem to be fighting a lot downstairs. I think. Oh, I saw parts. I don't need parts. That's silly. I would use starts as a legitimate weapon ammo anyway. 
Unless you intend to, you know, subdue enough kill. How are you still alive? Is there another flop? I guess I just misunderstood and the fighting is probably downstairs, not upstairs. Roach! Let's empty. It's a pilot fight. They do even Oh, sure, let's grab a spare. Let's not be a thing. We do need a lot more blade there. We need it right now. Let's look at the condition on my shish kebab. It's almost broken. Oh, hi, I didn't see you there. Right. Where is the loot? I kinda need to look at this loot. There's a first aid box, which is kinda filled with the loot. And some drugs and journal of modern medicines. Move along, please. You're my minion now. I will not take your orders. So technically you're not my minion, you just set here to protect the facility from uh Books. Bugs. No longer shall you fight for the purpose of killing everything, including communists. Ah, I was hoping that would explode. It didn't not it did it it did it did it not explode. That didn't didn't explode either. are advised to clear the area. Well, I'm gonna set some corpses on fire. I may be able to Move clear the along, area after that. Please. Why is there an area like this in the cafeteria and offices mean? Let's just nuke a cola. Maybe if it was quantum, I'd pick some up. So it have the nuke cola chemist perk. Which is what is used to turn regular nuclear cola into cold. I mean, um, uh, quantum. Just don't know what, why they would put radiation in a drink like that. Oh well. Crazy people, crazy times, eh? Or crazy times, crazy people. Whichever way. I think I'll just uh, give the quantum directly to the girl once I have it. And if the situation goes wrong, well, I'm gonna stab the guy I was unable to find for really ages in the watch. If it's shish kebab. Try his sausage, if you know what I mean. Ow. I. I I don't even want to think about that idea anymore. That was terrible. Let's not do that. That would hurt. I think. A lot. I believe. Let's just not do that. The fellow human being. Especially since human beings are very rare. Pork beans. Those are common. But human beings are rare. Hey, protection. Why are you protecting? Along, please. Fine. I can't step over the table. Hi. Get in my belly. Uh, remember kids, don't eat steam packs. That's actually unhealthy for you. Remember kids, invent steam packs. And then don't eat them. Thanks. Alright. But I think they're just trying to Move kill all the fucks.
At least I'm not directly in the danger now. I have left the danger zone. What is this area? High protection. So many ghosts. No? Fine. So nice to have just a pile of robots clean up the area for me. Oh wait, that's where I came from. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I saw something. Thank you. So basically they have these huge robots for pest control? Oh well, they invented them, so they do what they want. I wish I had a recipe for something amazing, like the railway gun. Guess that sounds fun. Hmm. What are you trying to get now? A roach? Sleeper buggers, aren't they? Alrighty then, I guess that leaves my business in this place performed. Cool. Move along, yes, yes, as soon as I remember how to get out of the place. Wait, but there are still other directions to explore. This is this area to explore as well. Quite sure I didn't come back here before. Let's get some books in me. Eat the book. Um, num, num, um, num. Yeah, good reading. Don't you read books if you're done? That's how you read books. Move along, please. Which isn't Move creepy at all. Along, please. At all. But you know. It's an effective way to make your way through a book. Just soak your tongue through all the pages coating it in, in paper and other things. That does actually sound very safe. Let's wait till morning. When was the last time I rested? Does anyone remember? I don't mean in the bed, in, in just in the wild to get the time changed. No, oh, anyway, uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. I don't know what the heck that is, but I'm gonna toss a grenade over this wall to see if I can hit one of those things, whatever that thing is. That's an invisible wall. Is that an invisible wall? That is not an invisible. That is an invisible wall. Let's see if we can aim it any higher to see if we won't hit an invisible wall. That was an invisible wall. Let's see if we can hit another one, and it was still an invisible wall.